Hi, my name is Tessa. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be demonstrating how to warp and weave the log cabin. The log cabin consists of alternating blocks. Here we have a horizontal and a vertical block which gives you the actual design. I've drawn up a draft of the two blocks. You will need two contrasting colours. Here I'm using black and white. In this box here I've got written eye and this one slot. That represents the eye and the slot in your reed. Now I've threaded a white thread through the eye, then a black through the slot, another white through the eye and you'll alternate as you go along. Here I've done it five times. White, black, white, black. Five times because that's the width that I like. You can do that four, four times and that will give you the width of that block. When you get to the last black here, you can see I've written here switch. This is how we switch so you get the other um, alternating block. So here where we have the eye, where I did the white at the first block, we're going to alternate and do black in the eye white in the slot, black in the eye, white in the slot, right to the end. And when you get down here, here we go, we have to switch again to the first block. Now the important thing with this is that when you're at the switch, you've got to make sure that you've got the two whites. So when you come back here, you've got one white there, one white there. Here when we switched, we had a black here. And when we switched to the second block, there's the black there. But I will show you how to do this at the loom. I've done the first two blocks, that's block one and block two. Now I'm back to block one. So you're going to go through the eye, pull your white wool through, around your peg, come back through here. Now with this one here, we have to cut it, otherwise we've got two in the one. So you cut it at the back, pull it through, and then we're going to thread that through the next die and pull it through and I'll just tie this off at the back. Then we're going to pick up our black, tie it on. You're going to come through the slot between that two white there and pull it through around your peg. Then when you get back here, because we don't want two in the one slot, we're going to cut it at the back, pull it out and put it through to the next slot and tie it off at the back. Okay. So we're back to the white again. Now we've already done four. I'm doing a sequence of five. So this is the last one. So through the eye. Pull it through round your peg and when we come back to the start we cut it down the back and when we pull it out this time we're going to just drop it to the side that one's just going to wait because that's our fifth fifth one in the first block go to your black tie on your black See, we've only got four underneath in the black, so we need five. So we're going to go into the slot, pull the black through, around your peg. We're going to cut that one off. Now this is the switch. So we've got five black and we've got five white. And this black we're going to take out and we're going to start the next block. 
So we need the two blacks together. So where this was in the slot, this is now going to go into the eye. And we'll just put that in the eye. Feed it through. And tie at the back. And I'll just show you in a minute. Here we have our two blacks together. That's the switch. Now pick up your white. This is the next block. And that's going to go into the slot. Find the next slot. And we're going to tie it off down the back. So that's how you do your switch. And you can see here, we've got one, two, three, four, five white, one, two, three, four, five black, and we're starting the next block. The one black one and one white one there. Now, if you find that this is a little bit too confusing, you can do this singly. So, To do it singly, tie on on the back beam. Now I'm up to the black, so I'm going to go through the eye. Pull it through, all the way through. And tie it off at your peg. Just like that. Then pick up your white, which is the next colour. And that's going to go through the slot. Pull it through and tie it up at the peg. And just alternate black and white, whether it's through the hole or slot, the eye or slot like that. Now to weave the log cabin, I'll be starting with the first block. So I'm going to take the white through the shuttle, through the shed. and beat, change your shed and you're going to come through with your black so you're going to weave this the same way as you warped it so we went light dark light dark so we'll do that for five rounds of each so that will make it ten picks so here's your black Come through with the white. Change your shed. Come through with the black. Put your shuttle behind for your next colour. Beat. Now I'll just show you here, if you can count how many you've done. So we started with the white, so I've got one, two, three white. And I've got one, two, three black. So we need five in each. So coming through with my white. Beat. Follow through with your black. Place it behind the white. So that's four in each. And we're going to go through with our white. Oops, you have to watch your selvages. And then through with our black. Now we finished block one with the black. Now this is where we're going to do the switch. So we're starting block two and we've got a black Going across, shuttle behind, and beat. And we're following through with a white, shuttle behind. And you can see here how that's changed positions. Let's 
go through with our black and beat white and beat there's it going in one direction and as you turned the switch it's in the opposite direction so that's how you get the pattern right so we'll continue doing the black white comes through with the black white again One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So we got one more pick of each. It's black. And that's the white. And there's your two blocks there, how it's switched over. Thanks for watching.